many people are titled and they've never even been charged with a crime ever. Let's talk about the hidden trap of being investigated in the military, titling. It's a process that can follow you for decades. Hey, I'm Cody Harnish, UCMJ attorney, and today we are discussing the crazy injustice that is the titling system. What does being titled mean? Titling happens when there's just enough evidence to suspect that you may have committed a crime. It's an investigative tool, not a guilty verdict. Being titled doesn't mean you've been charged with anything. What it does mean is that you came under a military investigation and your name was entered into a report, a DOD database that's going to stick around for 40 years. You heard me right, 40 years, simply because you were investigated. How does this happen? Let me explain. Imagine some junior investigator in the military. They often are gets a lead and then talks to a prosecutor and suspects you of committing a crime. Boom, you're titled, done. That's the whole process. Kind of messed up. Why is this allowed to happen? Well, according to DOD instruction 5505.07, the moment that there is credible information of wrongdoing, you can be put on the list. And this can impact your security clearance, job prospects, and much, much more. Like if you want to go buy a gun, apply for a federal job, it's going to follow you. The good news is that in 2021, the National Defense Authorization Act now allows you to appeal this titling decision. There is now a process to challenge it and potentially clear your name. Unfortunately, it's really, really hard. You have to show that there was no credible information in the first place or mistaken identity and not mistaken identity like, oh, I didn't do it. It was this guy over here who did it. No, like your name is Joe Smith with the last four of one, two, three, four. And the person who was supposed to be put in the report was Joe Smith with the last four, four, three, two, one. Yeah, there is hope though. You can apply. It's going to be a long process. If you're dealing with this or you're worried about this, Follow for more information on military law and the military justice system, and don't let a simple investigation define your life. In the meantime, I'm going to continue what I've been doing, defending America's defenders.